For this spontaneous reaction part two, we will do a reaction that we have seen before. I'm going to use barium hydroxide and some ammonium chloride. I have a wooden block and I have a small beaker. Before I start the lab, however, I'm going to squirt some water on the wooden block where I will place my small beaker. I'm then going to take approximately 30 grams of each of the white solids. So barium hydroxides first. I'll take a scupula and I will spoon in approximately 30 grams. So 30 grams. Let me get another scupula out here. For my ammonium chloride. Notice I'm taking my ammonium chloride now. Let me get some good pieces here. I'll put about 30 grams of that as well. All right, I'll take my stir rod. I'll take my two solids and I will stir them. We'll notice that the change of matter is changing on this from our solid. I want to also note that the smell is pretty strong. Keep stirring a little bit more to get all of the solid pieces broken down. Let's try this out. I want to touch this. It is cold to the touch. So you want to note that for part of your lab. Also note that it is successful. I was able to lift the wooden block. It got that cold that it froze to the wooden block. Pretty remarkable.